Hello everyone, here is a question from partial number. The question is, what number should be subtracted from minus 5 by 3 to get 5 by 6? Now here, uh, let me just frame it. What number should be subtracted from minus 5 by 3? So from minus 5 by 3, what number has to be subtracted so that the answer will be 5 by 6? Okay. So this number is unknown to us. This is what we have to find out. Now, so we always assume the unknown number to be a variable, right? So, I'm going to assume a variable A here and I'm going to start solving it. So, let's write down. So, first we're going to consider, we're going to just assume it. So, let the number to be subtracted be equal to A. Okay, I'm assuming this. Now, when I frame it, like I said before, so from minus 5 by 3, what number to be subtracted? From this, what has to be subtracted? So that we have taken as A. So minus A is equal to 5 by 6. Now remember, I have seen many uh, students writing A minus uh, 5 by 3. So it's like you're subtracting min uh, 5 by 3 from A. So the sentence is like the meaning of this is changing. So don't do that. This will be the actual equation. Now it's like a linear equation you're solving and uh, you have to find out the value of a. So I'm going to transpose this minus 5 by 3 to the other side. So it will be minus a. The sign of negative uh, a is minus so keep it like that. I'm going to change it later. 5 by 6 when you're transposing signs will change. Negative will become positive. Minus will become positive. It will be a plus 5 by 3. Now you're adding it to rational numbers, but here the denominator has to be same to be added. They're not same. So we're going to make it same by taking LCM of 6 and 3. So LCM of 6 and 3 will be equal to 6. So change uh, the denominator of both the numbers. So minus A is equal to so for the first number, we already have a 6, right? So we don't have to change anything. You can write the number same, 5 by 6. But for the second number, we have to make it 6. So I'm going to find out the equivalent rational number of 5 by 3 with the denominator 6. So you have learned that rash equivalent rational numbers can be found by multiplying or dividing. So I'm going to multiply here 3 uh, with 2. 2 because 3 2 is 6. So same 2 you have to multiply in the numerator 2. It's like finding the equivalent rational number. So minus a is equal to 5 by 6 plus 5 2 is 10 so 10 by 6. Now denominators are same you can add the numerators. So minus a is equal to 5 plus 10 divided by 6. So 5 plus 10 is 15 so we'll get 15 by 6. But we have minus a. I want only a value, I don't want minus a value. So a will be equal to the minus sign you have, right? So you have to multiply or you can take this minus sign to the other side. You can do that or you can multiply minus sign on both the sign, both the sides. So it will be like minus into minus a and then minus five by 15 by 6. So it will be minus into minus is plus and you can do the 15 and 6 you can cancel it or you can uh, in a 3 table or you can just leave it like that. So a value will be equal to 15 by 6 or uh, minus 15 by 6 or if you cancel it will be minus 5 by 3. Cancel this in five, a 3 table it will be minus 5 by 3. So that's it. Uh, sorry minus 5 by 2 you will get because 3 2 is 6 so minus 5 by 2. Now that's it. I hope this question is clear. In case you have further question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.